I am very pleased that this opening ceremony of the 13th Congress of the World Federation of Nuclear Medicine and Biology, WFNMB, is being held with participants from many countries and regions around the world. The very first Congress of the WFNMB established in 1970 was held in Japan in 1974 with their majesties the Emperor Emeritus and Empress Emerita, at that time Crown Prince and Crown Princess, attending the opening ceremony. I am delighted to deliver an address to this Congress that is being held in Japan for the first time in nearly half a century. Nuclear medicine is a medical field that uses radiopharmaceuticals to diagnose and treat various organ diseases. It plays an important role in the diagnosis of Alzheimer's disease, cases of which have been increasing worldwide, as well as in the diagnosis of myocardial infarction and other heart diseases, and especially more recently in the treatment of cancer. I understand that the main objective of the WFNMB is to promote nuclear medicine throughout the world and to support developing countries in this field. I would like to take this opportunity to pay tribute to all those worldwide who have worked tirelessly over the years for the development of nuclear medicine and to all those in Japan who have continued to play an active part in cooperation with countries and regions around the world since the establishment of the WFNMB, making this Congress possible despite various challenges brought about by the COVID-19 pandemic. I expect that this field in medicine will spread more widely throughout the world, thus leading to the improvement in people's health. I would like to conclude my remarks by expressing my best wishes to all participants of the Congress and that you may deepen your knowledge and expertise through diverse discussions and exchanges with other participants. I hope this Congress will achieve great outcomes and be a contribution to the further development of nuclear medicine.